welcome to this week's weekly vlog. Today is Monday. Today Alice has gone back to school. So she went back to school this morning and uh, it's still early, it's still morning, late morning and it's time for Leo to go to school today. He's only going for 45 minutes, sort of like a welcome session and I stay with him. So I'm going to go to that. Um, we're going to leave in about five minutes. And then this this evening, I am going to see the Life of Pi in Sheffield uh, with my brother, if he turns up. He says he's not even booked his train ticket yet, so hopefully he turns up because I wouldn't have gone on my own. Um, but yeah, going to go and see the Life of Pi for the press nights. That should be fun. I'm not looking forward to getting home though because I don't get back in time to get the last tram. I'm going to have to get the late bus and it's the last bus of the night, so I hope it turns up. Anyway, I'm going to go get ready now to take Leo and I'll get back to you later. So I've just arrived at the tram station. I've got three minutes till the tram. And I couldn't find my headphones anywhere, so I'm going to have to make the whole journey with no headphones. <laughs> so I'm not happy. But anyway, it's only a small tram, so I'm going to move up here. And, but yeah. So I've just arrived at Piccadilly train station. It's going to go up now. I think I've still got half an hour till my train. And I think it's going from platform four. So let's go and find the platform. Okay, so I've arrived at the train station and I've got half an hour now till my train. It's going to be at platform four. Um, so I think I'm going to go to the shop, maybe see if I can buy some headphones and get something to eat. Okay, so it's now 10 minutes till my train, so I think I'm going to head to the platform. I'm not sure if my brother's getting this train or if he's getting a different one. Just a message him in a minute. Uh, platform four.
So it is now about 10 past six. I've just arrived in Sheffield. And let's see if I can remember how to get to the theatre and find somewhere to eat. So I'm gonna see if I can find my way now. Okay, so I'm so proud of myself. I found it so easily today. So this is the Lyceum Theatre where Life of Pi is on. Obviously, I've got quite a while yet. <laughs> got a little sneak. I wonder if they've got any merch. Let's see if we can see inside. Oh, yes, they do have merch. I can see. Ooh. Yeah, definitely have an easy. Uh, obviously I'll show you when we go in but there is lots of merch so yeah it's a theatre okay so now I've found the theatre I need to go and get some food before it's time to go in so I think I remember where the Little Spoons was that I went to last time just around the corner so I'm gonna go there get some food and then it should be time for my brother to meet me so I'll get back to you in a bit so I found the weather spoons that I went in last time. So I think I'm gonna go in here again for the banker's draw. See if it's busy or not. There we go. I sat on the same table set up last time. Just here. So I ordered my food on the app and it arrived really quickly, probably about 10 minutes. So just got a buttermilk chicken burger with chips and a drink of Diet Pepsi. So I'm just gonna eat this now. Got quite a while, so I'll probably finish this and maybe have a walk around. Okay, so I've finished my food in the Weather Spoons here, and now I'm just gonna head to the first. My brother's train is due in in like four minutes. So he said he'd meet me at the first, so I'm just gonna head to the first and then hopefully he'll meet me there. So I'm just walking to the theatre now, just found the stage door, I mean that's for the Crucible Theatre, just there, there it is, I'm just walking up to the square now where all the theatres are, to meet my brother, so yeah, this is the Crucible, just here. Some posters for some shows that are coming to Sheffield soon. So Drifters Girl, and then there's these ones here as well. 
Ooh, so I'm just gonna find somewhere to sit and just wait for my brother before I head in. So I've always wondered what this building is. It says Winter Garden. I might go and see if I have a look in if it's not closed. A quick look. It looks like you can still walk in it. So it is about half past now, I see everyone's heading in. So it starts at 7.45, I'm just waiting for my brother. Hopefully be here in a minute, because obviously I need to film some bits before it starts. So hopefully he'll be here any minute. We are in the theatre now, we're just going to find our seats. I can't remember what row we're on. I need to check, but I'll just show you when we get there. Okay, so just heading into the theatre now. Are we row R? I think we're in the centre, so it doesn't matter what side we come in. Yeah, this row. 10 and 11, aren't we? Okay, so we're in our seats now. This is the view from our seat. I'm in on the R seat 11. This is the theatre. I'll show you more of the theatre in the interval, but it's really pretty.
is now the info and I really enjoying it. It's so good. All the puppets are really detailed. And yeah, I'm just really, really enjoying it. The info can't wait for the second half. Obviously, I'll give you a full review when I get home, but so far, I'm really enjoying it. I just thought I'd come up to the circle and just give you a quick view from the circle level. This is the circle. It's a beautiful theatre. Really is stunning. But yeah, anyway, I'm gonna go head back down to the stores now. There's the bell, so I'll get back to you now uh, at the end. has finished now it was so good really really enjoyed it now we're gonna go and get our train home but it was such a good show okay so we've arrived at the train station now our train is at 10 46 i think we've got like 10 minutes 15 minutes something like that so we're gonna go look. might already be here anyway because finishes its first stop so we might be able to get on air already we'll go and have a look and then we've got to try and get home. <laughs> so we are at the train station now. We don't know if this is our train. It's at the right platform, so you'd think it is, wouldn't you? I think it might be. It's not due for another 15 minutes, so... It must be this train, mustn't it? it? Must be this one? Yeah, I'm pretty sure it must be this one. We'll see. We'll give it five more minutes. Okay, so we think this is our train, so we're going to go and get on it. So we're off the train, uh, it literally, it's supposed to get here at 12 minutes past, it literally got stopped, like just coming in just to get onto the platform for like 10 minutes, so now I'm not going to make the last bus, which is so annoying. If it got here on time I had 20 minutes to get to the bus stop, now I've got like 7 minutes and there's no way I'm going to make it in 7 minutes, so I'm having to get an Uber with my brother, if one will pick us up, because he said last time I wouldn't pick him up from here. So, if it doesn't then we're sort of screwed because there's no way we'll make the bus if we tried to get it now. <sighs> At least I'm with my brother, because if I wasn't with my brother, I don't know how I'd get home. 
because I've never got an Uber before, I won't even know how to do it. So anyway, I'll let you know now when I get home. Hi, so I'm now back home from the theatre. I had such a good time, really enjoyed the show. It was really nice to spend a little bit of time with my brother as well. And yeah, I had a really good night. Unfortunately, I don't know what happened with our train. It was on time the whole way, and then once it's pulled, started to get to Manchester, um, to once it got to uh, Piccadilly train station, Manchester Piccadilly, it seemed to stop uh, before it pulled into its um, platform. And we're waiting there for 10 minutes, 10 minutes, which meant I was not gonna be able to catch the last bus because the last bus uh, was at half past and it meant that we didn't pull in till 22 minutes past. So I only had about eight minutes to get to the bus station and it probably takes about, it's probably, well it says it's an eight minute walk um, on Google and it probably would have taken me about eight minutes so I would have been pushing it as to whether I would have caught it or not. So in the end me and my brother got an Uber together and it only cost four pound more and I actually got to go all the way to my house and have to walk from anywhere so it probably was the better option. I just couldn't afford an, an Uber by myself but when we did it together it was okay so that's how I got home anyway and yeah I had a really lovely time so I'm going to get back to you tomorrow now because it's quite late and yeah I'll see you tomorrow. Hi, today is Thursday. It is currently half three. I'm just about to head out to the train station because I'm going to go to the press night of Cuckoo tonight at the Liverpool Everyman Theatre, a theatre I've not been to before, so hopefully I'll be fine. I'll be able to find it. Also, I'm sorry about the state of my face. I had a bath. When I have a bath, it just gets so red. So my face is really red today. Anyway, I'm going to head out and get my train to Liverpool. I should have enough time to get some food once I'm there and then head to the theatre. Hopefully I'll be able to find it. My friend James is actually coming with me. Originally my sister was supposed to be coming with me, but she wasn't able to come. So luckily my friend James was able to step in. So he's going to come with me tonight and it should be a good show. So I'll get back to you now, probably once I'm at the tram station. So I'm just at the tram stop now. I'm much later than I was hoping to be. It is three minutes past four. And my train's due at 4.37. So it's gonna be a rush. You put your hands to the sky, center of the crowd, you're the talk of the town. I tell myself I don't want that What glitters sink gold I tell myself I don't need it Cause I'm fine on my own But I hate being on the outside Looking through a window I say I don't want it But I'm so full of it I wanna be the life of the party I wanna dance with somebody So I've arrived at the train station. I did actually get here on time, but the train was an hour delayed due to a fault on the train. So I've been to the information desk and they said that I can get the 454 train, even though my ticket was a different train company. They said apparently it can be used on this one. So hopefully he's right. Uh, so I'm gonna get on that one instead because that other train is still at Sheffield, it's not moved for over an hour. So, 
I reckon it's probably going to get cancelled. So, let's go get this. Okay, so I've now arrived at Liverpool Lime Street. A lot later than expected. It was a nightmare journey. My train got cancelled, and then the next one was just absolutely heaving. Oh, it's awful. So, yeah, it's now seven minutes past six. Um, I should have got here for half past five. So, over half an hour late. But just got to wait for my friend now. So I've got an hour till I need to go to the fifth, so I might get a little bit of something to eat in here if there's anywhere to sit. Get a drink. So it's now about 20 past six, just got my food. I'm just going to eat this quickly and then head to the theatre. I think it starts at half seven, but I need to be there by quarter past, so yeah, just going to eat this and then head to the theatre. I'm in row, row F seat 1 and 2, so we're going to find our seats. Ooh. Oh, it looks nice. F 1 and 2, there we go. It's good feeling the end, isn't it? Oh. So we're sat in our seats now, we're on row F, I'm on seat 2, <coughs> and this is the view. So there is an interval, so I'll get back to you at the interval and let you know our interval call. Hi, 
Okay, so it is now the interval and I'm really enjoying it. It took me a little while to get into, but it's really good. I'm really enjoying it so far. Looking forward to the second half. This theatre is really nice. I've never been to this one before. And it's really it's quite modern. I think it must be, is it new this, James? Is it a new theatre? Do you know? Well, it's about 10 years old. Oh, really? Because it looks really new. It looks really nice. So I'll show you the bar area. It's got like disco lights going on. Um, but yeah, it's really nice. So, as you can see. In the bar, you can see the disco lights and stuff. Yeah, nice. Oh, look. What was that saying? Oh, you can um, oh. thingy on the chairs. Like. So it's now time for the second act. We're just waiting to get our seats because we're on the end. But we're on row F, seat one, two. And I think I said before the view's really good. But yeah, really looking forward to the second half now. And obviously, I will give you a full review when I get home. on the way because it's really hot. Well, so I'm just going to go and get our train. I'm a bit early but I think it's already here so I'm going to go and get on it. Yeah so this is our train. 1020 train to Manchester Piccadilly and it's already here so I'm going to get on it, get a seat. to rush to get the last tram so I'm gonna quickly get to the tram station and I'll get back to you now once I'm at home. So I've just arrived at the tram station seven minutes till my tram so not too bad. Looking forward to getting home now. time tonight had a lovely time catching up with my friend James and the show was really good I really enjoyed the show oh yeah it was a good good evening oh getting there was a pain I'm not sure if I filmed very much about it but when I got to the train station my train was um delayed and when I looked it had been stuck at Sheffield for over an hour 
um, said because the train had a fault. So I went to the information desk and said, um, do you think this train is actually going to turn up or do you think it's going to get cancelled because it's been stuck at Streffield for an hour? So we had a look and he's like, mm, yeah, I'm not sure it might get cancelled. But he said, but you can get on the next train. I said, am I, am I okay to get on the next train because it's not the same um, train company? And he said, yeah, it's fine, just get on the next one. So I just got on the next one. And um, yeah, so I was a bit later getting there than I was hoping. Um, I think I ended up getting there like half an hour later than I should have been there. Uh, but I still had time to get some food and stuff, so it was all fine. I just was a little bit rushed at the theatre, so I probably didn't film as much as I would usually film. I'm not even sure how much I've done, we'll have to see, but anyway, um, I'm going to head to bed now because it is quite late and I've got a busy day tomorrow, so I'll get back to you in the morning. Hi, today is Friday, the kids have just gone to school and me and Lawrence are about to head to Primark because we need to get a few things for Leo, Lawrence wants to get a few things, so I'm going to go to Primark get back in time to pick Leo up because he finishes early. He finishes at, does he finish at one? One fifteen. One fifteen. so we need to be back at least by one. And then this evening, me and Lawrence are going to the Hope Mill Theatre to see Lizzie, so we're really excited for that. So yeah, I'll get back to you now once we are in town. We'll have a look and see. Yeah, so we're at the tram station now. Lawrence is just getting our tickets. Okay, so we've just arrived at Primark now. I'm gonna go downstairs, I think, first. Look at the kids' clothes and find socks for Lawrence. This dinosaur bedroom stuff is really cute. I think Leo would love this. These are so cute, these cushions. Really cute, and then they've got picture frames. Artwork. I do want to change Leo's room and he does love dinosaurs. And they got some wall stickers as well. It's really cute. And then they've got mermaid stuff for the girls. Leo Alice does like mermaids. But I think she wants an angel room. These are cute. Oh, that's really cute. That cushion. Picture frames. Quilt. Sticker details. So I've just finished up in Primark. Now Lauren's left a little bit earlier to go and make sure we're back for Leo so I just stayed to have a little bit of a look around so I've finished now so I'm going to go and get the tram and get back home and I've got a lot of reviews to write Hi, so it is now much later been back to sh from the shops for hours the kids are home, they're just having a dinner my parents are going to pick them up at any minute to go to their house because Lawrence and I are going to go and see Lizzie the musical, hopefully gonna have time to go and get some food beforehand, we'll see. I apologise for my face because I don't know what's happened to it today, but it is the reddest it's ever been. It's an absolute state today, but never mind. Anyway, so yeah, we're gonna get ready, head out, hopefully we can get some food before the show, otherwise I'm gonna be starving. And I'll get back to you once we're there. So we're just at the tram station now. The tram's due in two minutes. And we didn't need to buy a tram ticket because we bought one this morning when we went out. Quite busy, isn't it? Good. So we're going to head into River Springs. See if we can find a table and get some food before the show. Okay, so we're in Weber's Foods now. Lawrence is just looking at the menu, seeing what he wants. We're going to order on the app though. I'll probably just get what I always get. I'll probably get the same as what I got yesterday, to be honest. Because I always get the same thing whenever I go anywhere. I just need to wait for Lawrence to decide what he wants. 
So our food has arrived. I have got a buttermilk chicken burger. Lauren's went for the ultimate burger. What's on the ultimate burger? Sorghum, tomato, sorghum, burger sauce, cheese, and bacon. And onion rings. So we've finished our food now, we're now going to head to the tram uh, to the Hope Mill so we get on it at Piccadilly Gardens and then it's two stops from there. Lawrence is trying to kill us. <laughs> are, these, are these what all the new buses are going to look like? Yeah. Are these the new Manchester buses I'm not interested? The B the Network. B -network. So we're getting the Ashton Underline one. It's six minutes, so it's not too bad. Okay, so we've just got our, our trap stop. New it's long turn up now. We're just gonna walk up to the theatre and I'll just show you the walk just in case people don't know how to get there. I always find this quite helpful because I always get lost. We got here early enough today to sit in the fancy seat for the showtime. We've always, I've always wanted to sit here. <laughs> Have you? Yeah. Yeah. So, yeah. so I've picked a look. Oh, a blondie. The lighting's not very good here though because of the sign. But I got us a blondie and a diet coat to show because we're quite early. I think it's what? Is it even seven? Yet? It's five to seven. So, and I also picked up a program. And that was five pounds. Yes, we're gonna eat this while we wait for the show. I was gonna take a video of Lawrence trying it, but he shoved it all in at once. Was it nice? Two bites. Two bites. Well, we shared it half each, so two, two bites. But was it nice? Yeah. <laughs> I've tried mine. It, it was very nice. Definitely recommend this one. So if you do get to the Hope Mill Theatre early, you can actually get food and stuff. 
So they do like, like nibbles, olives and sweet potato fries and things. And they do pizzas. I mean, we got a pizza once. I think it was when we came to see Head Over Heels. And then a lot of drinks menu. They tend to do like a couple of cakes and things as well. But yeah, those are what you can get. Okay, so we are in our seats now. We're on row D, seat three. I'm in seat three, Lawrence, seat four. This is our view. I suppose we'll start any minute, so I'll get back to you now in the interval. Dialogue is it? It's telling the story mostly through song, aren't they? Really? Uh, the bit of this, yeah. yeah. Well, yeah, really enjoying it. Really looking forward to the second half. And um, we'll give you a full review when we get.
Is your secret safe now? Our secret So we are at the tram station now waiting for the tram. Six minutes, but the show was amazing. I really, really enjoyed it. What about you? I really enjoyed it. I enjoyed the music, I enjoyed the pace of it. I enjoyed the walk with the just like guitar, drums. Yeah, fast. all the music was really good, all the songs were great. Definitely recommend it, but we'll tell you more about it when we get home. musical i really really enjoyed it definitely one that i would go and see again and yeah we're both really tired now so probably gonna go and head to bed and i'll get back to you tomorrow hi today is sunday i think the last time i got back to you was friday after we went to see lizzie i uh, don't think i've got back to you since then but yesterday lawrence was in work so it was just me and the kids at home and i more or less spent the whole day editing and stuff on the computer and playing with the children didn't really do very much then when Lawrence came home in the evening we sat and watched a new Little Mermaid movie which I wasn't too impressed with I think maybe I need to watch it again because The Little Mermaid is like my favourite Disney movie but yeah I think I might need I think I was quite tired so maybe I need to watch it again to enjoy it more so I think when I'm not so tired I might watch that again and see um but today the plan was to go to the shops because Leo needs some trainers for school. However, neither of the kids want to go out. Um, they want to play in the garden. So I think we're not going to bother going to the shop. Um, I think they're just going to play in the garden. I have got a lot of work to do on the computer. So I'm currently just doing my Instagram um, stuff, reviews uh, for Instagram and that's what i'll probably do today it actually takes a long time uh, like doing a review vlog and that can often take me like an entire day just to edit and then doing all this as well so it's like a full day's work doing all the bits for a review so it does take a long time um so i'm just gonna do the instagram ones today and get them done so i've got cuckoo to do I've got Lizzie to do, um, I've got uh, the ones from London still to do and next week I've got quite a few shows so I've got three shows next week so yeah I've got a lot to do so I need to try and get all this done this week because I'm going to have lots to do next week so I might just do a time lapse of me 
doing this just so you can see what it is that I do. And yeah, I'll get back to you in a bit. later now everyone else is in bed so I thought I'd better finish the vlog so we didn't really do much I didn't really do much else today I just finished Ed doing a bit of editing and that's basically it so I hope you've enjoyed this week's weekly vlog um next week is quite a busy week I've got we're going to see three shows next week only one of them is a press show so I might not do reviews for all of them I might just do the one press one because I'm quite busy um and yeah I'm also gonna head to copy craft tomorrow and um use my vouchers so we're gonna go there and I think that's all we've got planned for the week so anyway I hope you've enjoyed this week's weekly vlog if you have please do give it a like don't forget to subscribe and I hope to see you again soon bye <laughs>